हेलो एंड वेलकम लेट्स टॉक अबाउट साइनस एंड फिस्टूला सो व्हाट इज इट मीन बाय साइनस साइनस मींस हॉलो और अ बे इन लैटिन अ साइनस इज अ ब्लाइंड इंडियन ट्रैक्ट दैट कनेक्ट्स अ कैविटी लाइंड विद ग्रेनुलस टिश्यू ऑफन एन एफसीएस कैविटी विद एन एपिथेलियल सरफेस सो व्हाट डज इट मीन बाय फिस्टूला अ फिस्टूला इज एन एब्नॉर्मल कम्युनिकेशन बिटवीन टू एपिथेलियल लाइन सरफेस and this communication or tract may be lined by granulation tissue but may become epithelialized in chronic cases classification of sinus it may be anatomical or pathological anatomical includes paranasal sinus and cavernous sinus pathological includes congenital and acquired congenital are preauricular sinus postauricular sinus umbilical uricular coccygeal and sacral acquired are pilonial sinus सचर पोस्ट सर्जिकल एब्डोमिनल और पेरिनियल हिर एडेनाइटिस सपरेटिपा एक्टिनोमाइकोसिस ट्यूबरकुलोसिस क्रोनिक ओस्टोमालिटिस एंड मिडियल मेंटल साइनस क्लासिफिकेशन ऑफ फिस्टुला इट मे बी कंजेंटल फिस्टुला और इट मे बी एक्वाड फिस्टुला नौ कंजेंटल फिस्टुला मे बी कंजेंटल इंटरनल फिस्टुला लाइक ट्रैक्यूसोफेकल फिस्टुला रेक्टोवेजनल फिस्टुला और रेक्टोयरेथल फिस्टुला और इट मे बी कंजेंटल एक्सटर्नल फिस्टुला विच मे बी अम्बालिकल यूरिनल फिस्टुला अम्बालिकल फिकल फिस्टुला प्री अर्गुलर फिस्टुला एंड अदर्स एक्वाड फिस्टुला मे बी एक्वाड इंटरनल फिस्टुला लाइक गैस्ट्रो कोलिक फिस्टुला यूरेटेरो भेजनल फिस्टुला कोलोबेसिकल फिस्टुला एंड एक्वाड एक्सटर्नल फिस्टुला मे बी फिकल फिस्टुला यूरिनल फिस्टुला पेंकोटिक फिस्टुला एंड बिलियर फिस्टुला एंड अदर्स क्लिनिकल फिचर्स अफ आई दर साइनस एंड फिस्टुला आर बोथ दे इज डिस्टार्ज फ्रम द ओपनिंग अफ साइनस There is no floor. There is raised indurated edge, indurated base, and non-mobile. Often, it is floating granulation tissue over the sinus opening. Both thickening in osteomyelitis. Surrounding skin may be erythematous, inflammatory, bluish in tuberculosis, excoriated in fecal fistula, and pigmented in chronic sinuses or fistulas. Now, discharge uh, typical of the cause will be evident, which will be obvious after applying pressure over the surrounding area. Induration is a feature of all chronic fistulas except tuberculosis. and there are others you can read from here you can read from here now investigations the these includes a uh, fistulogram or sinusogram using ultra uh, fluid lipoloral or water soluble iodine dye and they discharge for culture and sensitivity acid fast bacilli cytology staining biopsy from the is for tuberculosis and malignancy chest x ray x ray of the part mri of the part esr ct sinusogram and other Now, treatment of the sinus or fistula, removing the underlying cause through excision or scooping out of the sinus tract and send and send for histopathology to determine the cause or the pathology behind the sinus and fistula. Biopsies should always be taken from the wall of a sinus or fistula to exclude malignancy or specific infections. Antibiotics should be given. There should be adequate rest and adequate drainage. Now causes of persistence of a fistula or a sinus. Local factors: these include presence of a foreign body or necrotic tissue like a sutural material, hairs, fecal liquid secretion, and others. Non-dependent drainage or insufficient drainage. Persistent obstruction in the lumen due to lack of rest. Persistent infection, or when the tract is lined by epithelium or endothelium, or dense fibrosis which may prevent uh, contraction and healing. Specific infection by tuberculosis or ichthyomycosis. Persistent discharge, ischemia, underlying malignancy, and post irradiation. There are systemic general factors include yes. immunosuppression, diabetes mellitus, malnutrition, and drugs like steroids or cytotoxics. Now, the differences between sinus and fistula. Sinus, there is a definition. A sinus is a blind tract and others. A definition is a fistula is a abnormal communication. This is a typical definition, and the tract is closed in sinus. And is open in fistula, and the openings uh, there is one opening in sinus, while there are two openings in fistula. There are some important points like uh, the typical features of tuberculous sinus or fistula include includes the mouth has irregular margin, surrounding skin is bluish and pigmented. There may be multiple openings. Age is undermined and discharge is watery. The different discharges in different uh, sinus fistula. The purulent is seen in case of the bacterial infection. Cases in tuberculosis, sulfur granules in actual mycosis, mucus in brachial fistula, saliva in peritoneal fistula, feces in fecal fistula, bile in biliary or duodenal fistula, 
bone in osteomyelitis sinus and urine in urinary fistula. End of the topic. Thank you.